Hello everyone, my name is H. Timbers, and welcome back to Persona 5. Alright, so without further ado, let's get back into this. Alright, so we are at LeBlanc. Again, ignore the message on the top left, since I'm using Elgato to record this. And let's go to bed. We're going to the exhibition tomorrow, right? Don't oversleep. It's Ryusai Matarame, an infinite font of ideas. Huh. I read the blurb on the ticket, but it seems that this Matarame is actually an amazing artist. Some of his pieces might be worth looking at, after all. Yeah, let's go to sleep. Yeah, let's go to sleep for now. The next day! Sunday, 15th of May. Alright. And it's raining too. What is this line for? Oh, that exhibition. Exhib exhibition must be opening today. It's really packed. Want to come back another time? I want it, but it's so expensive. Maybe I should take out a loan. I want to see that. Let's go together sometime. Yeah. Here we go. And it's still raining out. Huh. So crowded. Huh. <laughs> Obviously. It'll be a pain in the ass if someone sees you, so don't stick your head out too much, alright? Alright. You came. Yep. Um, yeah. You really came. Uh, yeah. We gotta make sure you don't, uh, try and, uh, take her kidnap on or drug her or whatever, and then you take her in the bathroom and try to, uh, Rape her and fuck her tits or whatever. Yeah, we got eyes on you, Yusuke. You don't want none of this. You don't want none of this muscularness that I got. Because I will fuck you up with it. Okay? So don't even try anything sneaky. What'd you expect when you left us those tickets? True. Make sure that you don't get in the way of the other visitors. And you make sure you don't, uh... Drug or kidnap on, and then take her in the bathroom and fuck her. Okay. Now, I'll show you around. I'd like to speak more about the picture. I'd like to draw too. Alrighty. Well, see you guys later. See ya, I guess. Will Lady Han be all right? What if he drags her behind some painting and try something funny? <laughs> <laughs> I feel you, Morgana. I feel you. But I don't think he would do it behind a painting, though. Because if he was to do it behind a painting, then that would be very suspicious. And that would automatically give them away. I feel like he would probably do it in the bathroom or somewhere more private. Okay. Bathroom. Maybe not private, but more private than behind a painting, that's for sure. I told you not to come out! Yeah. But, uh, we gotta make sure nothing happens to her, you know what I mean? Are we really gonna appreciate the fine arts? Can't we just go home? Let's learn more. Let's learn about Matarame. I guess we should do a quick pass through at once. Yeah. Uh, which way are we supposed to start? Oh, no. Hmm? It's that old man from the other day. Oh. We continue to be truly surprised by your imagination. You have such expansive styles. It's hard to believe that it all stems from one person. Wow. Where in the world does all your inspiration come from? Well, it is rather difficult to put into words. They naturally well up from within my heart, like bubbles rising one after another in the spring. I don't get it. Naturally, you say. What's important is to distance oneself from worldly desires, such as money and fame. True. I mean, I do commission artists, after all. Not just for the money and fame, but to also support them as well. Especially since some of them have lost their jobs during this pandemic. Yeah. My atelier is a modest shack, but it is more than enough to pursue true beauty. Yeah. Shack. What about it? I see. 
So the act of emptying one's mind gives rise to inner beauty. Oh, that would make, that would make sense. Because if you just ignore the toxicity, then eventually you won't get bothered by it. Unless those people are trying to make up lies about you, then that's when you need to strike back. Still, to think we could hear the word shack coming from the great artist Madarame. You would understand if you saw it. <laughs> what do you mean by that, Madarame? And fun fact about him too, his voice actor also voices Simai in Dice Wars 6, 7, and 8. Yeah, I found that out a while back. Wasn't the word shack something? Not really. Madarame-san is actually here? Um, yeah, what'd you expect? Over there! What? I'm so glad I came on opening day. Okay. What the hell? Okay, hey, stop pushing. My god. There's way too many people. Yeah. I'm getting crushed. <laughs> I feel bad for you, Morgana, but unfortunately you're gonna have to deal with it. Anyways, we gotta head for the exit. Don't die on us, alright? Alright, I'll try not to suffocate from all these people. I didn't know there were so many types of Japanese art. Yeah, me neither. Usually, one concentrates on their own style. However, Sensei creates all this by himself. He's really? Special. Oh. There you are, Yusuke. Yeah? Sensei. Yeah. Ah, the girl from yesterday. Are you enjoying the exhibit? I don't know how to huh. put it into words, but it's really amazing. Cool. You're sensing something from the artwork. That alone is enough to give us artist satisfaction. Oh, cool. <laughs> the only satisfaction I really do for artists nowadays is show appreciation and also give them as much credit as I can on Twitter by quote retweeting the art that they make for me and then Posting that quote retweet that I made into a fleet so that more people can see it as well. I hope this becomes a wonderful piece, Yusuke. Well then, if you'll excuse me. Yep. Alright. Later. You'd imagine artists would be difficult to approach. But he seems really friendly. Indeed. Mm-hmm. Oh, this is it! The painting I wanted to see in person. This one? Yeah. I guess it's the painter's anger? I'm not sure, but I sense this strong frustration from it. Hmm. To think such a cheerful and gentlemanly person could make such a piece. I like the one on the far left, though, with uh, Mount Fuji and all. Looks very peaceful and whatnot. <laughs> Something wrong? Yeah. Don't mind me. There are better pieces oh. than this one. Come now, this way. Oh, come on! It's about hey. yeah, it's about appreciation, ain't it? It's not about showing off or whatever. Trying to decide to say which one's better and which one's not. Ah, that old lady totally elbowed me. Oh! That I remember now. Remember what? About what? Well, let me get to it. All right. It's about a post online. Yeah. Here, look at this. What is it? Why'd you leave without me? Damn. You got it all wrong. We got dragged into this huge crowd and... Yeah. Eh, anyways, you gotta look at this too. What is this it? This post might be about Madarame. What is it about? What's it say? A master of the Japanese arts is plagiarizing his pupil's work. Only his public face is shown on TV. Oh shit. Plagiarizing? I didn't think much of it when I first saw it, but hearing Shaq and Madarame triggered it. Hmm. His treatment of the pupils who live with him is awful. He teaches nothing and bosses them around. Hmm. He treats them inhumanely, as if disciplining a dog. Damn. Abuse on top of plagiarism, hmm? <laughs> if you want to ask me who the... American version of Madarame is? I'd say it's Butch Hartman. <laughs> Fuck that greedy ass punk. Ch 
charging 200 fucking dollars for a commission and has the audacity to trace some of them. Literally. There were at least like two or three that I know of that he's at least traced. Like literally, they're not even original work. They're just somebody else's work that you just copied over. If this is real, it'll be a huge scandal. Yeah. But despite that, I would want to see what my character, or at least Sackboy in Butch Hartman's style, would look like, though. Just to see how bad he would do it. I wonder if Kitagawa-kun posted this. Yeah. I mean, he is a pupil of his. Yeah. Who knows? It's anonymous and all. Yeah. In that case, it's possible the Madarame we heard about in Mementos is referring to the same one. Yeah. A man like that doing such a thing? Possibly. I wonder if we can ask that shadow from earlier about this. Oh, oh no. Nah. Actually, we just need to talk to him in reality. Yeah, plus his shadow is gone. And how are we gonna go about that? Are we gonna explain it all, starting with mementos? No. Besides, if we make a move out in the open, there's the possibility that Madarame will find out. Yeah, that is true. Oh, yeah, right. Hey, what do you think about Madarame? Doesn't he seem suspicious? Yeah, that he does. That thing fits his know, description. Right? This all fits way too well to just be a coincidence. Yeah. If this post is legit, ain't this the kind of target we've been waiting for? Yeah. Well, yeah, but is it really true? I would like to believe way, so. What did you do about the whole modeling thing? Kitagawa Kun gave me his contact info. Oh, really? And the address to his sensei's atelier. Oh. He said he lives there, right? Perfect timing. Oh. We... Let's try going tomorrow. We're off to Madarame's house right after school. Alrighty then. Huh? You want me to model tomorrow? Don't worry, we'll be there. This is too sudden. I'll have your back though. What? We're just gonna go talk to Kitagawa. Yeah. Oh, that's what you meant. Yep. Okay. In any case, we need to find out if that rumor about Madarame is true. If it is, this might just be exactly what we needed. Alright, yeah. Let's go to bed. Again. Well then. Let's call it a day and go to bed. Yeah, let's sleep. Alright, here we go. Yeah. Yo, I wonder how the LVP community would honestly react once they see Butch Hartman's drawing of Sackboy, though. Oh, yes. Oh, yeah, the great artist Madarame is holding an exhibition in Shibuya right now, isn't he? I've gone to see his work a number of times. Goodness, are they magnificent. The moment I saw them, I knew he was something else. By the way, you seem far removed from the arts, Timberskun. Here's a question. Do you know who created the piece which sold for the highest price back in the 20th century? Alright, I'm doing this without cheating. It's... Oh, sh... Oh, I'm being honest with you. I didn't even know about that shit. The... Use a network to see everyone's answers. Oh my god. I didn't even know about that. But yeah, it's Van Gogh. Oh, not bad. That's correct. It seems you know a thing or two after all. That piece was purchased for the equivalent of 18 billion yen. And sold for even more later. However, since the turn of the 21st century... A new record has been set practically every year. Hey, did you know that? I had no idea. Maybe he actually is smart. I'm kind of surprised. Oh shoot, the teacher's glaring at us. Wow, you must be really smart to be able to answer a question like that. Alright. Alright. Knowledge has improved. People put a serious amount of passion and money into art. 
If I had that kind of money, I wouldn't mind having a painting or two of m or two myself. <laughs> well, basically, the only art that I buy is digital art. Yeah. Because I have a lot of fan art online. Most of them I've bought from artists, but some of them I get free. Either just by requesting it or trading something that I make in Little Big Planet for a piece of art. Seems like art can make you a tidy sum. Let's see with our own eyes whether or not the accusations of him stealing art are true. You're meeting Lady On and the others at the train station, right? Let's go when class lets out. Alright, yeah. After school. Come on. Fam thieves going by train? This ain't any different from how I get home from school, you know. True. The train's the fastest way to go, plus we can bring pets on here. Oh, cool. No. Hey, who are you calling a pet? Um, you my dude, cause you a cat. Okay? So shut up, my dude, and get back in the bag. Dude, be quiet, we didn't pay the pet fare. What the fuck? There's a pet fare? Okay, now Shibuya is acting greedy. Okay, I'm the one guiding you to your destination. You should be calling me master. <sighs> okay, master. It's you. Oh my god. But no, I could call him master, considering that he's my most favorite character in this game. Hey. Ooh, kitty. Well, at least my most favorite character out of all the Phantom Thieves. At least. Er, oh, shoot. Is that your pet, mister? I heard it meowing. It's a stuffed animal. Yeah, it's just a toy. It meows when you press on its head. Oh, I do know that there's the uh, Persona 5 Take Your Heart Premium Edition, and it actually comes with a Morgana plush. I really want it so bad. Hey. You heard her, Harold. Press on its head. This is ridiculous. we again, again. I should press gently. I'll press forcefully. Time to button mash. Yeah, pick the third one. Yeah! <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. That is just too funny. <laughs> He's like, no. He's like, I'm dead. They're just staring at him like, um, is he alive? The Joker's like, um, I think I killed him. <laughs> Alright, enough of that. Like, ah ha ha, that's so funny. I want to hear it again. I just threw up in my mouth. Seriously? The next stop is Shibuya. Shibuya. Doors will open on the left side. Oh, this is our stop. Well, see you later. Bye bye. <laughs> Mm hmm bye bye all right later all right here we go yeah. so which line do we got transfer to doesn't look like there are any close any stations close to by to that address if anything this is the closest station For real? what then we gotta walk the rest of the way what kind of Phantom Thief takes the train and then walks to their destination? Stop your complaining. It's supposedly a shack, but this is the neighborhood he lives in. As expected of a famous okay, artist. Looks like the fastest route is to get to Station Square and then move to Central Street. Let's move. Alright. Station Square. What the hell? This is the same route I use to get to school every day. This ain't no different. Anyway, Wait. Central Street. Sure, it's this way. I don't remember seeing a house. Um. It's supposed to be in a residential area past Central Street. We'll have to walk a bit, though. Okay, let's get going. Alrighty, then. Suguru Kamashita, former Olympian, teacher at Shujin Academy. Yeah. Returning himself in is... Uh... 
A heavy conscience, huh? Yeah. The human mind doesn't change that easily, let alone their natural temperament. Yeah. <sighs> Shujin Academy. Seems doubtful. Yeah. Perhaps I'll have someone look into it. Just in case. Yeah. But who is he gonna have look into is it? Is that it? What the hell? That's the house he lives in? I would have expected it to be... You know... A mansion or something. But a shack? We're at the right address. Yeah. The door plate does say Matarame. Yeah. Uh, you ring the bell. Yeah. Me? The walls won't collapse when I do, will they? Oh, stop over exaggerating. No sneeze or we'll blow this house down, okay? <laughs> oh god. Who is it? Sensei is currently. Yeah. Um, it's Takamaki. I'll be right out. Wow. People really do fast. live here. Yeah. Takamaki. -san. Huh? You two are here as well? Yeah, we got to make sure you don't Fuck her. Because you might not be modeling and you instead might rape her. So we gotta keep our eye on you. Okay. Hey. Sorry, yeah. but uh, we ain't here to talk about the modeling thing. There's something we gotta ask you. Yeah. Is it true Matarame's plagiarizing stuff? He's abusing people too, yeah? Yeah. Are you serious? Hey, we were just asking a question. We're just curious. We read about it online. Yeah. This? Yeah. <laughs> the hell? <laughs> he sounds like either Simai or Simashi laughing. Imposterous. Not only is the plagiarism impossible, but abuse. What? But surprisingly enough, he's also voiced by a former voice actor for Dynasty Warriors. Yusuke is voiced by Matthew Mercer, the person who voiced Taishi C in Dynasty Warriors 7 and 8 as well. If he hated children so much to harm them, he would never allow pupils into his home. You sure about that? And I'm the one residing here and studying under him. I'm saying it's not true, so it's beyond doubt. Okay. You might be lying about it. True. That... that is utter rubbish. You look like you're lying. I had no family when Sensei took me in and raised me into what you see now. Um... Okay. If you continue to ridicule the man I owe my life to, you will rue this day! Oh, uh, what? You really think that? Yeah. Oh, what are you gonna do? Bring it back to the Three Kingdoms era? <laughs> okay, I need to stop making these jokes seriously Yusuke what's yeah. the matter I heard you yelling oh these people are slandering you with baseless rumors we we're just asking about a question we weren't trying to make them look bad at all we was just asking something forgive them Yusuke yeah they must have heard some bad rumors and came in worry for their friend's safety yeah Understood, Sensei. Yeah. Well, even I doubt that a cranky old man like myself could be liked by everyone. True. That's not what we meant. Yeah, because once you're huge, then people start being a dick to you. Because I've seen people act like dicks online before. Plus, there was that one incident with uh, Jacksepticeye where his uh, dad died and people made fun of it and made memes out of it. That was fucked up. Seriously, it was. I'm sorry to have butt in on your conversation. However, okay. I do have neighbors around. Won't you please keep it down? Okay. If you'll excuse me. All right. <clears throat> that was discourteous of me. I'm sorry. 
It's all right, man. I know. I think you'll be able to believe in Sensei if you saw that painting. It's his okay. main work, as well as his most representative piece. It's titled Sayuri. Sayuri? Sayuri? Mm. This was the painting that inspired me to become an artist. Cool. It's so beautiful. Hmm. I don't know all this fine art stuff, but even I can tell that this is impressive. Yeah. When I first saw you, I felt the same powerful emotion as when I saw this painting. Huh? Me? Yeah. I wish to pursue beauty like this. Okay. And I believe drawing you will be part of that pursuit. I implore you, seriously consider my offer. I. I'm sorry that you took the time to come all this way, but I must assist Sensei today. I hope okay. that we can discuss this further another time. If you'll excuse me then. Okay. Those two seem like nice guys, don't they? Yeah. Maybe the Matarame we heard about in Mementos is a different person. I don't know, because Matarame, he just fits the description as that post online. He fully fits the description of that post from that anonymous person online Man, on the fan site. I only thought we found a new target, too. Yeah. How's the MetaNav? MetaNav? Oh, yeah. Hey, the app. What? Was it picking up our conversation? This display. Yeah. It means that Madarame has a palace too, right? It could be. But why? I don't know. Madarame, plagiarism, and then Shaq, huh? These seem to be the keywords. Yeah. For real though, what the hell's going on? I don't know. Does an old man like him really have a palace? It could be possible though. We have the person's name and the location. Doesn't matter what's age. left is the what that Madarame mistakes the shack for to enter his palace. Yeah. You mean like how Kamoshida thought the school was his castle? Yeah. That's right. Let's try saying some things. Mm -hmm. They can be random guesses. All right. It's a bit sudden, though. All right. Why don't we start with castle? Okay. No then Damn. what about prison? No yeah. Found. Damn. Ah, oh, what a pain. Yeah. Jail, a warehouse, and guidance counseling office. Might as well add farm. No the hell? Not a single hit. Yeah. Should we come back another time? Uh, building that's related to artists. If we think from there, what would it be? Hmm, not sure. Oh, a museum. Oh shit! Getting navigation. Whoa, really? We got it. Here we go. Hope y'all ready for this. Cause we're going in. Here we go. Hey, wait! Hey! When did you activate the nav? You surprised me. Didn't have much of a choice. I think we just happened to get it right. What if I hadn't noticed and then wandered off and got caught by an enemy? Come on. You probably would have figured it out once you started walking on two legs. True! Uh, so even you can slip into the metaverse without realizing it, Morgana? Yup, in a place with minimal cognitive distortion, the differences can be subtle. What? Forget that, look! The fuck? That shack is seriously some kind of museum? Hey! Let's go check it out! It's a long ass line. It's so extravagant to the point that it's gaudy. It's yeah. a museum, right? Yeah. This is Matarame's? 
Yeah. The palace is a scenery driven by desires. Just like how Kamoshida's palace was a castle. Yeah. Madarame's artwork is on display at museums in reality too, though. His like yeah. was popular, and people already respect him. Why would he fantasize about a museum? I oh, don't know. You got a point. It ain't related to plagiarism or abuse either. Yeah. Let's try looking around. Racking our brains here won't do us any good. Yeah. Right. That okay. aside, ain't a museum a must for phantom thieves? Uh, yeah, definitely. Now that's our Joker. I feel the same. Yeah. But man, just look at that insane crowd. Yeah. Well then, it's time we begin our infiltration. Uh, are we going to have to win that gigantic line? Don't be stupid, we're not going in the front door. But there's a high wall around the building. We'll just have to find our way up over it then. In any case, let's get going. Yeah. I think I'll save for now. Yeah. Alright y'all, so, I'ma end the gameplay right there. And if y'all enjoyed, please like and subscribe. Or it helps out and for the game videos every day. But anyways, guys, I love you guys. Thank y'all for watching. And as always, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.